Okay, so today I'm going to uh, create a mask file for my Linux Motion camera that I have running on a Raspberry Pi. I want to exclude areas of um, my front porch from detection. So if there's a car going by or some people are walking in front of the main road on the property I don't want to detect it. I basically want to detect this area when somebody comes into the path of the house. So I'll start by creating a new layer. And the layer has to be the same size as the image that you've set your camera up for. So mine happens to be 640 by 480. Um, then what I will do is I'll fill the whole area with white using the bucket tool, which is the background color. And then I'll start working on the areas that I want to exclude for motion detection. So I'll use the rectangle tool and I'm going to start in the upper left hand corner at 0, 0 and go oh, approximately 150 pixels down all the way to the right is uh, 640. Sometimes it'll be a little bit tricky and now I'll fill the box with black as required by motion again using the bucket fill tool. Okay and there's also a right side of the image that I want to exclude because I sometimes get light reflections off the wall in the morning so again I'll use the rectangle tool start at the lower right and go up to meet the um, first box and I'll use the bucket tool again uh, to fill the area okay and uh, now what I'm going to do is just do an overlay to see how it looks and I'll do the overlay and I'll put the image back so now you can see the area that I want to exclude is shown okay so now I can delete the original picture that I used as the template for uh, creating the screened out areas. So I'll delete that layer. Now I can go ahead and save the file uh, and it needs to be saved as a PGM file. So um, So it's PGM. I'll just save it as mask number one. And export it. And motion requires that it's in a raw format. So I'll accept the default of raw and export it. Okay, so now I've saved the file and now I can exit GIMP and then I can load the file onto my Raspberry Pi and then set the uh, mask file in the config file for motion under the directory where I'm going to store it and you can either edit the config file or um, use the the web tool at port 8081 and edit it this way and then set it and then uh, s save it by writing it um, to the motion config file. So that's it on the tutorial. Thanks for watching and I hope this helped uh, creating a mask file for motion.